Are you kidding me right now, Ollie? Good morning, you guys. I am cleaning up this kitchen, and Missy is still not feeling good. She sacked out on the couch, or this is just part of her whole elaborate plan to feel sick so that I clean up the house. Is that is that what's going on right now? I think that's so funny. I laugh so hard. <laughs> no, she actually just got done throwing up. I just have been wanting to clean up a little and I cleaned the stove look at that and I cleaned the counters I did the dishes I got the grocery order in we sent the order last night online and they delivered it right to us this morning so it was really cool now I'm gonna sweep and mop and Missy you can be my little audience yeah. huh he's doing my chores it's hard to sit here and watch me do it but it's really it is it's hard it really is. I clean very good don't I all the fans are on is bugging me. Well, I'm hot and sweaty. I need the fans on. I'm a big guy cleaning your house. I don't know. It's just I hate watching people clean my house because it just feels like my job. And it just, it just like, it's like, stop doing my job. It's hard. I told Missy, I was like, why don't we get a maid? You're pregnant. It's hard for you to keep up. I don't want you to. So I was like, let's just get a maid. They'll come once a week and they'll sweep and vacuum oh, trust and me. stuff. Trust me, trust me. The conversation went a little bit differently. I've <laughs> and I kind of Okay, guys, if you want to if you want to suggest um, getting a maid to your wife, plan that conversation out because I probably didn't say it as smoothly as I was supposed to. And now look what I'm doing. I'm stuck cleaning the house all on my own. Look at all that dog hair. That's like a whole other karma. This is the only time I would recommend using the devil's help, okay? Otherwise, stay away from him. He's a bad guy. But this thing actually works really good. <laughs> now I'm steam mopping, steam mopping, oh yeah. This thing is really hot. Very, very warm. It's really nice though. This is my favorite thing in the whole world. Really, Missy? This mop is your favorite thing in the whole world. Really. This mop right here is your favorite thing. Texted my mom the other night. I was like, oh, I'm in love with my mom. Starting to sound like your mom. I know. And she's like, why are you saying, oh, I was like, cuz, how can you love like a cleaning thing? <laughs> Just sounds like the future. Well, hey guys. I finally have some makeup on my face. I have my hair done. I'm still not dressed, but I'm getting there. Good thing about my whole pregnancy is that. I have some really, really sick times and some times where I'm just like, I can't get up. But I seem to be able to get dressed and get my hair done and makeup done every single day and I even can usually leave the house. That I'm really, really thankful for. Ollie's still napping, being such a good boy. He's so good at sleeping, actually. Funny story, I, I actually signed up before I knew I was pregnant for a bachelorette party over the weekend. Like, this weekend, I would leave tonight and um, be gone until Sunday. But I ended up having to opt out of it because I just really didn't want to go to a bachelorette party and feel so sick and not be able to get out of bed and not be able to find anything like that I want to eat or can eat without throwing up. So I'm working through this. I'm, I am excited to be back to myself. It is really, really hard for me to be sick. I do not like not being being able to do things because on normal days like I clean my house I take care of Oliver from morning to night basically and you know I'm busy like I, I'm a mom really, I am a stay-at-home mom and stay-at-home moms are busy it is really hard for me to not be that person and I'm really trying not to like get down about it I mean I am lucky I have a husband who is here with me as well who can help out a lot and so I'm really thankful for that but it is hard it is really definitely hard to not like be able to take care of like simple things around the house this is actually the fourth time I've been pregnant which I know can be sometimes hard to to say because it kind of has a, a sad part to it I, this is my fourth time going through the first trimester and it is just as hard as the first time and I definitely know how my body is and it's funny but when we first started daily vlogging we had the conversation to daily vlog 
I'm going on a three-minute clip. Uh, we had the conversation, the daily vlog in December, and we wanted to start in on January 1st, but I told Brian no because I really didn't want to vlog. Like, the first thing that we're vlogging would be, like, my first trimester with Oliver, and I just really didn't want people to see me and how, like, I am in my first trimester, trimester which is, like, pukey and sick and exhausted and just I look terrible and I act terrible and it's hard. And so this is the first time I've actually filmed my first trimester trimester and I hate it. <laughs> I hate seeing myself how I am and I hate people seeing me in a way where I just, I'm sick. I'm sick for like weeks. It's not even just like a couple days sick. It's like I'm sick for a few weeks. Long story short, I hope this passes soon because I'm ready to be back to my old self. Are you kidding me right now, Ollie? <laughs> what? Pound it. Go pound it. Uh. You see, he's wearing a hat right now. Yeah. <laughs> and he put it on backwards. I put it on the right way. Yeah, he, we put it on the right way, and then he took it off, and then he tried to put it on backwards, so I helped him out, and then he left it. I guess he likes it like that. He's like, I don't want something in front This is too much. I'm sorry. You are so freaking cute. You have so much swag right now, it's not even funny. It's slightly too big for him, but it's so cute. He's gonna grow into that hat though. It's really nice. This is a hat from Sly Fox Threads. It's all white and it's got this cool little uh, leather thing. Yeah, I'll link it below because we get a lot of clothes from them uh, and they're actually good friends of ours. So yeah, and it's cool. Their stuff is so cute. Like they have the cutest clothes for like people who are pregnant. Or yeah. Moms or dads. Oh my god. Yeah. So they have really good baby stuff too, including hat. Also, he has extremely bad bed head right now, and we don't okay. want to do his hair because uh, we're gonna go grab some lunch. I'm gonna go reward myself because I've been Cinderella all day. I think I figured out what I want. Oh, wow, well, what do you want? I want a salad from Texas Roadhouse. Oh my gosh, are you serious? I really need it. All right, Missy, your wish is my command. <laughs> I'm not only playing the role of Cinderella today, but also the fairy godmother, obviously. Am I Cinderella every day then? No, I'm Cinderella. Well, I guess Cinderella. Cinderella? Is that the masculine version? I don't know. By the way, we should see that. I know, I really want to. And uh, yes, Ollie's still wearing his hat and it's freaking adorable and we're trying to contain ourselves but we're not getting our hair. I'm so happy right now. I actually got chicken in my stomach and it seems to be staying and I actually feel really good right now. Chicken there was so good and like, I feel like I got something actually somewhat healthy in me. I really haven't been able to eat anything, like nothing. Well, let's just hope you don't see it in about That's what I'm 10, worried about. 15 minutes. <laughs> I really don't want to <laughs> see it, but I feel good. What are you laughing at, Ollie? Yeah, what? Tell me. Are you laughing at karma? Is he being so silly? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you want to go swimming too? <laughs> but, no. <laughs> nah, nah. He doesn't know the difference between no and yes. Brian made me so jealous that he went swimming yesterday. So I'm getting in. Although, if you can see, it is a filthy pool. Landscapers came and they, I literally watched them blow stuff into the pool. So it's pretty filthy. I tried to skim it a little bit before we came out here, but it's. I might just have to get in and do it too. Oh, what is this? Daddy would not be happy about this. We are hanging by the pool. It feels so good. Ready? <laughs> and you're back and then you turn and then you kick, kick, kick. Kick, kick, kick. Not kicking. Karma's having a really fun time too, aren't you, Karm? We're in the pool. You ready? Get it. Get it. get it, Carmen, get it! Go in there, silly dog. We're gonna be doing this all summer long. As I get bigger, like I'm gonna love getting in the pool and yeah. just like kicking and like just swimming. Totally. So I did this. I put him right here. <laughs> and then Mama got here. And then kick, kick, kick. <laughs> Alright you guys, you wanna see our new car? Oh yeah! Jaguar, <laughs> baby! It's even green. We wanted to get the same color as our Prius. <laughs> this is nice. Should be pretty cool. Do those things still like, like beep when you lift them up? Oh, I don't, I don't know. Do they do that? I remember my grandma had a Cadillac and if you like lifted up the Cadillac sign on the front, it would like honk. Oh yeah, because everyone steals them. I'm like, who steals money? stuff like that? Yeah. So I'm wondering if it's not a thing anymore. They, I think they still steal them, yeah. I wonder if it honks. I wonder if they put them on there a little bit better. <laughs> All right, Brian dragged me out of the house. Earlier he's like, I really want to go see a movie. And I was Cinderella, like, Cinderella. I really don't think I'm real too. Like, I don't feel good. But I was like, I'll let you know if I feel better. And you know, we'll go. And sure enough, I feel okay right now. The drive definitely Yay. got me. So I feel pretty good. I'm happy because I really wanted to go see Cinderella. 
And so Cassie's watching Ollie, he's going to bed, and we're gonna go watch this movie, no. and hopefully... We just put up the monitor, the Good. monitor's in our purse. Yeah, <laughs> I can just, we'll just watch him. It. He sleeps all night anyways. And then we were home. Missy just ran upstairs because she had to throw up. So, but she said she felt really good during the movie, which was awesome. And the movie was really, really good. And Helena Bonham Carter stole the show, like usual. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you are new, click that subscribe button. I don't know where it is, but you can click it. Because uh, we put out videos every single day here on the YouTube. Thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. What? This is home.